I'm a medical student and now I'm going to show you how to give a bed bath. So first is we need to gather all the things that we are needed. So first we need a mild soap, a towel and a washcloth, a waterproof bed pad, two basins for washing and rinsing, and also a warm water. Hi sir, good morning. I am Carla, your student nurse for today. And now I'm going to assess you to take your bath, okay? Yes. So sir, uh, may I know your name and your birthday, sir? I'm Bernardo Sanil and my birthday is August 10, 2013. Okay, thank you sir. So, sir, this bed bath will help you to keep your skin healthier and also it makes you clean, okay? So, do you want to take a bath, sir? Yes. Okay, thank you. So, first thing you're going to do is to put your gloves on and now we're going to check our patient's skin for any open areas, rashes, redness, cracking, flaking, or anything like that. So, sir, may I see? Okay, so next thing we're going to do is to cover our patient for privacy and to make him warm and comfortable. So next thing we're going to do is to put the waterproof bed pad and the top of it put the towel. So kindly move this side, sir. So put the waterproof bed pad under the back of our patient. On top of it, put the big towel to protect the skin of our patient from the plastic and to absorb the water. And now we're going to put our patient closest to us. So, sir, can you move here, sir? Next thing we're gonna do is to remove any clothing or pajamas or the gowns. Okay, we're going to remove the So, all we need to do is to wash, to rinse, and to path dry. Now let's start with washing their face and their neck. So we're going to use the soapy water first for washing their face and neck. Okay. So make sure to be gentle and don't rub it because it will damage the skin. And also use a mild soap or cleanser. Okay, now we're going to use another cloth and put it on the water to rinse the face and neck of the patient. Okay, now use another dry cloth to dry the face of your patient. So now we are going to help our patient washing their arms and their hands. So now I have here a towel and make it lengthwise and put it under the arms of the or shoulder of your patient. Okay, and now we're going to bath the arms and hands of the patient with the soap and water with um, long firm strokes from this towel to proximal. So now let's proceed to his chest. So we're going to fold this bath blanket down to the umbilicus. Now we're going to wash using the soap water. And now we're going to wash the nails and hands of our patient. So we're going to soak it in two to three minutes. Okay. And now we're going to remove this. Okay, so now we're going to pat dry his hands. Now we are going to change the water. Now we're going to help our patient to wash their abdomen. And now we're going to use the soapy water first. Let's wash it. Okay, so keep it covered, the abdomen, and 
while washing and rinsing. So we're going to wash. Okay, so now let's move on to the lower extremities and we're going to wash their leg first. Okay, so we're going to use the soapy water. We're going to wrap our hand like this. So now expose the one leg and the one and other leg is covered with the blanket. Okay, so we're going to wash with the soapy water. Okay, so next thing we're gonna do is to put our patient's feet on a basin and soak it for a few minutes. Okay, so once it's done, we're going to pat dry. Okay, sir. We're going to change the water again. And now let's proceed to the perennial hygiene. Okay, so now let's proceed to the back and botox of our patient. So we're going to position our patient in a side lying position. So sir, can you turn this way, sir? Okay, now we're going to wash it with the soap water. Now we're going to remove the towel and the waterproof bed pad. Okay, sir, can you turn this way, sir? And now I'm going to help my patient to put the gown. Okay, so first is we need to put this sleeve on his arm. So, sir. And now turn your patient back here. Can you turn this way, sir? Okay, so now turn this way back, sir. Then put the other arm on the sleeve. So now I'm going to ask my patient if he needs help brushing his teeth. So, sir, do, do you need help brushing your teeth? No, thanks. Yes, I will do. Yes, okay, thank you, sir. So, do you need anything else, sir? No. Okay, thank you. Thank you.